Hey guys, Carlos Graves from DroidDog.com here, and today I'm going to show you a cool Twitter app called Twika. Uh, it is free in the Android market, it's still a beta, but it is shockingly good for a beta. Uh, right now it is probably my favorite Twitter app, um, so I will show you everything it has to offer. So there it is, the icon right there. Uh, I actually really like the icon, although it doesn't really fit that well with the other stuff on my screen, but, you know, that doesn't really matter. Okay, so we'll launch the app, and it is quick to launch, as you can see there. Um, and you'll s first, the first thing I notice is the, just the really minimal, minimal uh, display of it, the interface. Um, you see the tweets right there, and then you see these little options on the bottom. I'll get into what those mean in a second. So just jumping right into this, if you click on a tweet, uh, here's a good one saying someone should make a video over Twika. You get tons of options. You get reply to selected users, so that'll open an at with the person that tweeted that. Uh, you get a retweet, which is the, the new retweet where it just retweets the actual thing. Uh, quote selected text, <clears throat> or quote selected tweet, that will give the RT at and then the user, so like the retweet that, the normal retweet that usually people like better. Send a direct message, uh, it shows you the uh, profile of the person. Add the tweet to as your favorite. Uh, manage the list that this person's in, or set a color label. Sorry, my hand is drifting off. Set a color label for what, for the tweet, uh, if you want it to be a different color, I guess. So just to show you the difference between retweet and quote selected tweet, retweet, it says retweet to your followers, I say no, quote selected tweet, gives you the RT and you can edit in there. So top to bottom, top, there's just, just the name, Twika, all across the top, simple. Then you got your tweets, there's a good quote about Twika, follow him by the way, he posts for Droid Dog, he hasn't gotten much followers, uh, he's a cool guy. At the bottom we have um, post a new tweet, uh, your at replies, your direct messages, and a little arrow thing that's for re uh, refreshing. Um, let me show you just first, because we're already here, how quickly it refreshes. You press refresh, and at the top, oops, sorry, I pressed on someone's tweet, you press refresh, and at the top it has like a little loading bar, and it's really fast, it is like Twidroid fast. Look at that. Damn, Twika is fast to me. And you'll see that it gave me a little uh, star at the pop-up thing. At the, sorry, at the at replies. Uh, so I can just click on at replies, and it'll take us to our at replies. It doesn't automatically uh, update them, so you have to refresh it by pressing that, and it'll do the same exact thing at the top. Uh, people... <laughs> sorry, dude. Be, yeah. Uh, I will show you what it is like to send a tweet, and I will reply to him. He said, dang it, you beat me to it, because he's also a video reviewer on Droid Dog. So I'm going to reply to selected users, and it opens up. You have to download a certain uh, plugin to actually get uh, media to be uploaded. Uh, if you just search, search uh, Twika, it'll already be in there, so it's really easy to find. It's not like a chore to find it at all. Um, but here we are, uh, you, that little arrow brings up the selected tweet that you are replying to. You just press back and it will go away. Um, if you're done, you press reply right there and it'll send. And as of right now, you can only attach pictures. Um, I, can you attach video? Yeah, you can attach pi pictures and videos. But you can't uh, put your location there. You can't do any of that yet. The recording it as I type. Smiley face. And then close that. And I'll hit reply. Is it sending? You can see how quick it is. And so at the bottom, you'll see this kind of confused me at first. Um, we're in the at replies right now. It says tweets mentioning at Carlos Graves. Um, 
at the bottom there is no main timeline or direct message, there's just send a tweet and refresh tweets. Uh, you have to press the back key right there to go back to your main Twitter stream. And there it is, recording as I type from Twika and reply. So let me show you what options this has. Well, what is in the menu right here. Um, there's retweets, so... Okay, this takes us to all the recent retweets uh, in your timeline, not just, um, not like in the whole Twitterverse. Uh, but these are people you follow who have been retweeted or have retweeted other people. Um, this is using the new retweet where it actually shows the person's profile as they tweeted it. Uh, so there's not a lot here because not a lot of my friends actually do that. Back in the menu, we've got favorites, takes you to your favorites, lists, um, let's see where that takes you. Okay, that takes you to the list you're following. Uh, you can create a list. Uh, so you can, if you want to do that while you're on the go. Uh, we've got home, which takes you to the main Twitter stream. I just pressed that. Uh, we have search. Uh, uses real-time search, so it'll update as you uh, as results come in while you're typing. Uh, and then we've got more, which is quite a bit more. You've got your profile, and doesn't look like oh you can edit your profile. Okay, so you can edit your profile got following and followers. I'll just go into following. So this is who I'm following. And then followers looks exactly like that, but for people who are following you. User search, oops, sorry. Uh, user search, and you can search for their name, pretty simple. And settings, and I'll show you what's in here. We've got account settings, which is just your username and your password. That's it. Got timeline settings uh, where you can just say like how many tweets, what the font size is, you want people to display their real names or their uh, screen names, status updates, um, just there's a ton of settings. I'm not going to go through all of them just because uh, I don't think I really have that much time. Uh, you can get, you can check mark what you want, uh, you know, to, what you want to be notified about. Sorry about the stuttering. God. Um, you can check what you want to be notified about, uh, or you can turn them off. I have don't check. You can every three minutes, five minutes, ten minutes, fifteen minutes, thirty minutes, one hour, two hour, three hour, four hour, five hour, and six hours. Uh, I have don't check because I am not really that into all that. And then plugin settings, which is right now only TwitPick, as you can see there. So that is Twika. Uh, it's available in the App Store for free. Uh, it is a beta, but just keep on the watch out for it, because uh, it is really nice, uh, and so I will see you guys next time.